Hello, welcome to the Friday Night Funkin' Koopa full week. So, I played, um, this, um, I guess when it was only, um, uh, I just had to full screen. But I played this when it, um, had only a few songs and then a bonus song. So now, it's got a full week and I saw this on Big Angel. And we got, um, I'm pretty, two new songs. I originally played Shells Rebound and Smashed, but now we got Cooper Roll and Running. So, I mean, the video, it did alright. So, um, I'll probably, yeah, I'll play through the entire, um, mod again. Uh, get, get to refresh my mind on this mod and get to experience a new song. So yeah, that's gonna be what's going on today. And yeah, if you're not subscribed, please do. It helps out the channel a lot. And let's go. Three, two, one, go! Three, two, one.
Three, two, one, go! Three, two, one. Alright, that was the um, whole Koopa mod, I think. Now let me just check to play just to make sure I'm not missing anything. And yep, I was. So, Shallow Scroll um, featured in the last um, version. 
And yeah, I guess it features again, obviously, because this is, you know, just on the, uh, they updated it. So, yeah, I mean, I guess I could start my outro while, um, well, give my thoughts about the mod while this plays, give a nice little background track, I guess. So, um, when, I guess, giving my opinion on these songs, I usually look for three factors artwork, which 99% of the time is good, and this is definitely one of the 99% of the times, so yeah, it's good. Um, charting, and charting has a few, like, subsections, it can either, it's like, step one is making sure it fits to the song, which this mod does. Step two is making sure it's not too spammy, which this mod does. And step three, making it pretty fun. Like, not just like random notes or continuous sections of the same, like, I guess, style, which this mod does. So, the second criteria is check. And then the third criteria, which is probably the most important, is the music. And music. Oh. Oh, there's death notes. Okay. Well, uh, I probably will finish my outro before this because I didn't plan on having their death notes. So, yeah, as I was saying, um, the third criteria is the music. So the music, um, is, I, I quite like it a lot. Hoopa definitely had the better week, um, compared to the, um, the Goomba. But the Goomba song was really cool. I really liked it. It definitely had a feel of, um, termination to it. And BS vocals in that also sounded pretty reminiscent of, um, Inkling Mistake from the X event mod, um, in, in the Sans fight. Uh, if I had to, like, name a sort of comparison. So yeah, uh, the music overall with the background tracks, um, sounded really nice. And the vocals, um, it's kind of hard to make a unique vocal and make it sound good because, um, I don't know. I feel like it's just pretty hard. I, in these sort of mods where they have, like, medium to low, like, they don't, like, blow up. Um, so either if the mod person's like, I guess, kind of new or something, usually I find that they have problems with, um, the way the vocals transition from one another, so the way, like, the flow is, and this, um, has really good flow, and I usually also find problems with, um, whole notes. Usually they have, like, whole notes that, um, don't really feel like it's a whole note. It feels like it's just a regular note, but you just have to hold it for some reason. But this, um, one has good whole notes. And even in the, I, one of the Koopa songs, like, I think it's the second or first one, where you have to hold down, and it changes, um, tune while you're holding it. I always love that kind of, um, I guess, effect. Whole notes are really cool and can definitely be used, um, more effectively than when I see them. So yeah, overall, um, this mod fills pretty much all the criteria for me for what is considered a really great mod. So yeah, um, and we're almost done with monochrome. So yeah, um, I hope everyone enjoyed this, and yeah, uh, let's just finish the song. Alright. That'll be it for me today, and see you all tomorrow in the next video. Goodbye.